okay in today's video we'll be looking at 2020 prophecies by prominent men of god in nigeria they raised a lot of prophecy for this year and i like you, you i know you love to hear some of them okay we'll start from uh, dr paul nh of the dunamis international gospel center he said there will be a plot to decristianize nigeria there will be threefold shift this year drastic shift dramatic shift and dimensional shift okay he said there will be infrastructure infrastructural release a season of revival raw evangelism and shift in the spiritual realm said that no level of frustration or intimidation will suffocate christianity out of nigeria say it's too late a season of signs and wonders that nigeria has never seen will come up okay he said there will be a change of order in nigeria that things will continue as they have been okay another pastor that said something was dr luke of the mountain of fire okay he said that 2020 is a wonderful year that many families will be rebreathed from the shackles of poverty and will retain their rightful position he however warned that there will be a great appalling of the doggish spirit that's the spirit of dog all kinds of sexual immorality and great sexual perversion so he urged members to flee fornication right there will be a lot of immoral sins this year oh. okay the next person that said something was bishop david oyedepo of the winner chapel worldwide he declared that the year will be a year of breaking limits he said that the bible is full of limits what breakers and it's time to get on that list believe i'm getting on that list of limit breakers this year i hope you'll be one of us okay join me on that list number three is pastor here at the way of the rccg reading christian church of god worldwide he said to be a year of series of joy victory but there will be a lot of battles we talked of earthquake and volcanoes that were erupted all over the world no oh, i'm so part of the world sorry there will be a change of government around the world and some will be peaceful while others won't be peaceful okay the fourth person is the wf kumi of the deeper life bible church the urge christians to look away from challenges and focus on ability of god to bring solution to their problems he said that 2020 is a year of possibility a year of solution he emphasized on truthfulness, faithfulness, obedience, and integrity, and won against laziness, oversleeping, and quitting. That's giving up. Another pastor that said something was Pastor Chris of the Christ Embassy. He declared that 2020 is a year of perfection. He urged Christians to think towards perfection, that humans can be perfect. He said Job was in the Bible. The Bible said that Job was a perfect man okay another one that dropped series of prophecies uh, pastor Mo omole divine hand of god prophetic ministry Apoja. he said about the efcc chairman being reappointed two governors who are serving senators that will be jailed the first lady needs special prayer to avoid the enemy's arrow he said of a terrorist attack driver that will ram into commuters in Abuja. we talked of um Prominent minister from the southeast that needs prayer. We talked of uh, Governor Rotimi Akirodoru, Akirodoru that must pray against terminal illness. He talked of uh, two major markets that will be engulfed in fire. He talked of kidnapping that will increase. He talked that petrol will add price. Now yeah, we will add price. It's a collapse of a major um, old generation bank larger church in the southwest one of the larger church in the southwest will be immersed in the scandal he talked of so many things the airlines that will face crisis talk of naira that will depreciate he talked of a um, former president of ghana that will win an election again we talk of chief of staff maram abba kayari they should pray against setup and um so many things he talked about so i have I hope uh, as you read me 